Hey there, it's Ben Larson at Unleash to talk about our puppy program, and this is such a fun one. Uh, so much benefit and joy comes out of us doing the puppy program at Unleash. So let's uh, get into it. Why, why you ask, do we do a puppy program? Uh, and boy, it it could not be. I don't think a bigger win win uh, as far as everything that can can benefit and help your puppy and us. Uh, from your perspective as a puppy parent, you get to bring your puppy to a place where they can be all day, two to three times a week, maybe more. Uh, we'll see what's right for your puppy. But they get the benefit of of being exposed to a bunch of different people, a bunch of different activities, socializing with other dogs all day long, as opposed to maybe you have a puppy. Uh, we all know we've had puppies. If you don't haven't had one, you probably still know it is a lot of work, potty training, dealing with all the energy, all the needs, maybe getting getting you up in the middle of the night, all that stuff, right? These puppies are a ton of work. And if you want to do a good job raising a puppy, you got to put the work in, right? Uh, to training, to getting it ready for life, all that stuff. Boy, we can help you with that at Unleashed. And uh, so that will benefit you in terms of having these, you know, all day sessions to do it with, as opposed to maybe an hour or two at like a pet shop you know, one or two nights a week. There's a good, puppy classes are good, but this is the puppy program. It's an all-day thing, and it's awesome. Uh, and it helps you from that standpoint. And from us, our standpoint at Unleashed, we get to play with puppies all day. <laughs> I mean, can you beat that? I don't think you can beat that. I mean, for instance, uh, check out uh, what we see here with Midtown and Coda playing, and we get to facilitate this play and then jump in sometimes. But uh, this is good, healthy puppy play, highly energetic, but they're just having a lot of fun, and uh, they're going to use the the uh, Karanda bed as a as a prop, I guess you'd say, to play with here. You'll see that in a minute. But we get to enjoy this, watch this, and just have a lot of fun with it uh, all day long at Unleashed. Uh, and these two have been coming now for a few weeks and seeing the benefits already. There's just so much that they can benefit from, including get off to that great start in life, right? Desensitization. What is that? Well, that is us as a staff working with your puppy to touch their ears, their mouth, their tail, their paws, get them used to being handled, introduce new objects to them, new experiences like, uh, you know, equipment like a broomstick or uh, strangers and new people all the time. How do they react to that? Uh, so many different things you can do like for instance, here's Midtown uh, working on the stairs, okay? So Midtown's working on the stairs. You can see he's a little shy, right? Not sure, not confident. Give him a little uh, tug that he needs. Okay, figured that step out. Still working. Okay, he's going to kind of slide down. And eventually, as we keep doing this and do it uh, for a few days, he's going to get the hang of how to go up and down stairs. And here he goes. He figures it out a little more. And then, oh, he's on the floor and he's happy, right? He made it and uh, builds some confidence. So all of these things are really great steps uh, for your puppy. That's one example. Uh, we go and, and introduce them to other dogs. And as the puppy program goes on and on, adult dogs. Uh, look, for the first 10 weeks, if you get your puppy in at 10 weeks, we go from 10 to 20 weeks of age in the puppy program. If you get your puppy in at 10 weeks, we're not going to introduce them to adult dogs yet because we are, don't want to uh, have too much risk of the spreading of diseases. Uh, everybody needs to be vaccinated. But as you know, is same thing with human children. Uh, the immune system is not going to have as much strength at that earlier age than it is maybe 15, 16 weeks. And at that point, we introduce them to adult dogs and carefully introduce them to the right adult dogs here that we trusted Unleashed to be a good steward for the puppies and train them on, okay, how to correct bad behavior. Uh, so that is part of the program later on. But early in the program, they just socialize with each other. So they have the socialization benefit all the way through, but not adult dogs until later in the program. But again, it's all about learning to manage everyday encounters. Uh, we're going to walk on different surfaces. Uh, we're going to be, uh, uh, you know, learning about stairs like we just saw, leash walking, uh, playing with the paws, ears, tail, and the mouth. We're going to do crate training. We have crates set up. They go in and out of the crates all day. They're in the crate while other people walk by, so they learn to control their impulses to whine and bark. And we help them with that. And so there's learning uh, the crate train. We'll help with potty training. We can't really dedicate the time it takes to completely potty train, but we'll help. And we run them outside to the right spots and give them a, a good reward when they do go potty outside. So we'll help with that. Uh, we're going to be introducing them to strangers, all the different staff members through Unleashed, working with them, different people throughout the day, plus learning to meet 
uh, new customers in our lobby and that sort of thing. So introduction to strangers, exploring different surfaces. There's all kinds of different surfaces. For instance, watch Coda here on the brick and then the cement and then going up the carpeted stairs. There's a wood floor. There's a turf play yard. There's grass. There's tall grass and short grass. There's gravel. There's blacked up. All these different surfaces to kind of learn uh, how to how to react and how to behave. And it's, it's uh, amazing how dogs maybe weren't too confident at first, but then they get exposed to all these different things. How about the rock bed? How do, how do you walk on that as a, as a new puppy? It's all new stuff and they need to learn it all. And they have the chance for these day long experiences to learn it here at Unleashed. It's really outstanding. So like I said, we socialize with other puppies. Then as the puppies get older, we socialize them with really good qualified adult dogs who can correct behavior. Like maybe the puppy's jumping in the face and trying to nibble and a dog will gently correct that behavior and the puppy learns. And it's awesome. So they learn from each other. Uh, they get that socialization benefit. Uh, and, and it's really great. Another wonderful step is uh, on the grooming end of things. We can go in and um, take the puppy into the grooming room, introduce them to getting baths. Okay. Getting baths. What's that like? How does it work in the bathtub? We have the sounds, uh, among other things, outside the grooming room. But in the grooming room, too, we have the nail filing sound, the buzzing machine, and get them used to that. Getting them used to maybe first light and then and then normally grinding their nails to get them used to a nail trim. Uh, great learning experience and great to get a puppy introduced to that early on. So there's the benefits there. We'll run a vacuum cleaner in the house uh, in, in our building. We'll run all this stuff and help them to learn how to deal and understand and manage these uh, behaviors. So again, the benefits are just off the charts in terms of getting your puppy used to being an adult dog and and confident in all these things. Uh, there are, of course, some risks. Uh, you know, just with anything else, there are going to be some risks. So we must make you aware of that, and you will want you to talk to your vet about it as well. Maybe you don't want to start as early as ten weeks because of some of the the disease risk, the respiratory disease, and some of the things that can spread with the with a slightly weaker immune system. We totally understand that. We do believe that the earlier the better, uh, you know, to, to get in and experience the benefits of socialization and desensitization. However, if you don't want to be that early, that's fine. You can come later. You can come later with your puppy in, in life, 15, 16 weeks, totally fine. Really up to you and your veterinarian. And that's we're on board with that 100%. And we will uh, introduce accordingly as the puppy program rolls along to what stage your puppy's at and help them along the way. But uh, we're open to all of that. And again, we are willing to start as early as 10 weeks. We disinfect our puppy area every day. Uh, we do not let other dogs onto the area if the puppies are going to be there because we don't want that risk to transfer over in terms of uh, possible diseases, that sort of thing. So we take precautions. But of course, nothing's 100% at all. And there is a risk. So we want you to be aware of that and uh, speak to your vet about that. But again, we work on the life skills. We work during this puppyhood uh, time frame. We do all of these different activities. It's a ton of fun, and we really enjoy uh, being uh, with the puppies and having the puppy program at Unleashed. So if you are expecting a puppy or you have a puppy and you want to get your puppy enrolled, give us a call, check out our website, use the chat bot, text us. You can email us. You can do all that stuff. You can check out our, our videos on social media and get in contact with us we would be happy to get your puppy enrolled in our puppy program and give it a try and uh, get your puppy off to a great start to experience life and experience all the benefits and all the things we can do for your puppy. And we'll see you and your puppy around here at Unleashed.